let's say you created a curve like this. Saved, went to somewhere else. And afterwards, you want to add another point out of here. So we would like to continue this curve. We could do this by selecting the curve, go to Curve Edit, Add Points, click somewhere else, and then we add an additional point. But you notice that actually alias turned my degree 3 single span into degree 3 two span curve, which is not preferred. So what I want to do afterwards is actually change this one to a single span. And if I really need to get the same amount of points, I mean, we added another point, so we want to change the degree. I can click on degree four, and you see that this curve is very close to the original curve. Of course, it's not equal. So in general, I would suggest try to understand how many points you really need, and then actually, uh, work with the degree and sculpt the curves. At one point you start realizing how many points you need. And the art of a surface modeling in general is to have the least amount of vertices, single span, and the most curvature or shape you want. So adding actually lots of points might be something we do a lot in Illustrator, but in Alias it's not necessarily a desired tool.